It really is the ultimate showdown. First versus second with the season winding down. We couldn't really ask for more. It's Manchester City. They face Arsenal live right here on EA TV. Hello everyone, well here's something we say every day of the week, don't we? It's a beautiful day for football in Manchester at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester City and they take on Arsenal. Well thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And the match begins. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson between the posts. Ilkay Gundogan plays with Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And a look at the starting lineup for Arsenal. Hakan Chalanolu plays with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And rather than use a strike partnership... Oh, Derek, got... what a chance this is. Oh, that is a superb save. Holland. Gundogan. And the keeper caught there. Keen to take it short here. Rodri. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Bukayo Saka. And he's in. And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. And they're playing again, and Arsenal are leading. Kevin De Bruyne. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Mares. So, a corner here. Trying to pick out a teammate. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Oh, 
taken short. Rodri. Well, a failure to keep the ball by Manchester City. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Gundogan. Holland. Through ball from De Bruyne. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Riyad Mahrez. The ball with Rodri. Holland. Now Mahrez. Holland. And a chance to level it. Still alive. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? And De Bruyne firing it over. Failed to keep hold of it. Gundogan. Superbly read and executed. As you can see, Arsenal are seeing less of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. And it's gone in for Arsenal. Will they be stopped from this position? So 2-0 now. Martin well, a scoring update for you in the United match. Alex Scott will tell us all. And it's a goal for Wolves. They're now behind by one with under five minutes left to play till half-time. Thanks as always, Alex. City pushing forward with options available. But the danger averted for now. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, they've given him too much space. Can he put it away? A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. So the game continues, and Arsenal cantering to victory now. And there we have it, that brings to an end the first half here at the Etihad. So the ball moving, the pendulum has already swung Arsenal's way in this game. Will we see more of the same in the second half? Not a decent idea, but just slightly overcooked. Gundogan, determined defending. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Rodri, Mare! That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop.
Put in by De Bruyne. No keeper will mind that sort of corner. Mares. Well, I'm hearing a goal has gone in in the United game. Alex Scott with the details. It's another goal for Wolves. Oh, hang on, Alex. Big chance here. Oh, good save. Here it is now, a substitution. Number 34, Lamit Shaka, to be replaced by number 4, Ben White. Short corner taken. Laporte. It's a perfect challenge. Is it going to be Riyad Mahrez? Palmed away by the keeper. Gundogan. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. He has teammates around him. Gundogan. And stuffing out the danger. Foden. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Mahrez. Foden. De Bruyne now. Gundogan. De Bruyne. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, as you can see, it's a really good pass from Gundogan. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. And breaking developments at Selhurst Park. Here's Alex Scott with the information. It's the third goal for Spurs. No one was marking him. He had too much time. And it was a simple finish in the end. They now lead 3-2 with 86 minutes played. Cheers, Alex. So there it is, the final whistle and a satisfying outcome for Arsenal and the many fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, it's a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today.
What a mouth-watering prospect this is. Two genuine heavyweights of European football, both with the potential to go all the way. It's difficult to pick a winner here. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. And welcome on a rainy night. The heavens opened earlier and it just hasn't relented. My name's Derek Ray and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. And on the menu, quarter-final action in the Europa League. It is not up against Arsenal. Well, Derek, when you look at the players out there, Arsenal have so many top-class performers. If they play well, this should be a comfortable victory. Starting lineup then for Nantes. Well, they've got a good front three and a solid back five, but with only two in midfield, they could get overrun. It'll be interesting to see who comes in to support them, if anybody. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Hakan Chalanolu plays with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. The first leg of this Europa League quarter-final is underway. Emil Smith Rowe has a go and a goal 1 0, and what a fast start they made to this game. is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Cathcart and he read it well defensively Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Will he finish? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him.
2 0 now and back underway. Ganago. In with a chance. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat trick. So back with the action and Arsenal sprinting away with ease. Sissoko. And they have possession again. Read it well, intercepting it. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Couldn't quite hang on. Well, they can keep possession now. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Defensive excellence there. Dennis Appiah. Now Sissoko. Using his physical strength. Chance here. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. And the counter looks on here. Options available. They need to get bodies back. And begging to be put away. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. That's useful play. Sizoko, a good and fair challenge. Arsenal could threaten from this position. Martin Odegaard. Opportunity! A goal! We're really being spoiled! This is attacking football at its finest! My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. That is that for the first half here. The start of the second half in this Europa League quarter-final first leg underway. Nice looking pass. Sizoko.
doing well to keep possession. Sizoko. Firing it in. A goal! He's dispatched it, much to the sheer delight of the fans. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Dennis Appiah. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Beautifully weighted ball. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Oh, he looks threatening. But Stout defending when it mattered. The final whistle, the first leg is over, and Arsenal currently in control of the tie. They carry a lead into the second match.